Hello baby cakes and welcome back to my channel. If you would like to achieve this eyeshadow look, keep watching. Okay, as you can see, I've already done my eyebrows, or what appears to be doing my eyebrows, with my Beauty Creations Brown Duet in Dark Brown. And I also used Elf Eyebrow Kit in Medium. I just used the powder part to cover my eyebrows. Right now I'm using Elf HD Lifting Concealer Light as a base and primer for my eyelids. I'm so sorry that the camera is not centered on my eye, but I'll get it next time. Don't worry. Now I'm going to go in with my BH Studio Pro Matte Press Powder in the color 235. I'm using that to set my concealer. Next, I'm going to be using my Martin Matte Palette eyeshadow from BH Cosmetics. I'm going to use this color that I pointed to as the transition color. I'm just using a fluffy eyeshadow brush to apply my transition color. Now I'm going to use that same brush and I'm going to use this slightly darker pink color as my next transition color. You have to put your eyeshadow on in layers and build it up. Next I'm going to use a slightly smaller eyeshadow brush and I'm going in with my darkest pink it's not the darkest pink in the palette it's the darkest pink I'm going to use in this makeup look I'm going to put some in the outer crease of my eye as well on my and on my lower lid just in the corner of my lower outer lid and with this I'm I'm using this more in the crease of my eye lid then I'm going to take my fluffy brush and blend. Next I'm going to take a small flat brush and I'm going to go in with the white color on the same palette and I'm just going to lightly pat it all over my eyelid. I'm trying to get an opaque effect so I could use this as a base for my glitter.
Next, I'm going to take my Bitsy Glitter Glue that I got from Sally's Beauty Supply and my Bits, Bitsy Body and Nail Glitter that I also got from Sally's Beauty Supply and that's in the color Stardust White. And I'm just going to take another flat brush and put some of the glitter glue on it and dip it into the Bitsy Body and Nail Glitter. And I'm going to pat that on my eyelid as well. Some people use mixing medium to apply their glitter on their eyelid. And I do have some mixing medium that I'm going to try next time. I don't really know what the difference is, but we'll see. I'm just patting that in to make sure it covers my entire lid. Next I'm going in with my BH Liquid Liner in black. And I'm just going to make a thin line. And uh, it's everyone always says that it's very difficult to put your liner on when you have glitter. And right now I am seeing that it is a little difficult. My hand is not that steady, so I do have a difficult time putting my liner on all together. But it is a little more difficult with the glitter. Okay, now I just went in and put on the rest of my makeup on my face, my concealer, and my foundation, etc. And this is the finished look. Thank you so much for watching and don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe. Bye bye. Also, products used will be listed down below in the description bar. Thanks for watching.